before, we were treated to some amazing peach cobbler empanadas. Tina, back in the kitchen with Chef Eric, this time making us some jambalaya, but this time, T, it's with a twist, right? With a twist, he says, right, Eric? Ooh, there's a I don't know, you always have a twist. Always, but <laughs> this one, we gotta wait all the way to the end for the twist. Okay, but you'll tell us about it. I'm gonna tell you all about it. So, next stop on the road trip, mm -hmm. Louisiana. Okay. That's where my dad's from. Okay. Pay a little tribute. So, super, super simple. Let's make some jambalaya. And then at the end, I'm gonna, tell, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna show that it's for everybody. Okay. If we can. How so, do we start here with broth? So yeah, start off with any sort of protein or, yeah, let's just say protein that you wanna start off with. I've got sausage, you can use andouille, you can use chicken, things like that. Okay. I've got this going and just toss it on in there. Just like what did you that. Put, did you put broth first? I did. What was that? Okay. Now, I put a little broth in there. Uh, a lot of people like to start with butter, but I'll kind of show you why I'm doing it that way okay. at the end of it. Sounds good. Um, or you can start with like veggie oil or things like that. Then after that, the trinity. Okay. Onions, bell peppers, mm -hmm. and celery, of course. Okay. Get that going. And then once that's going around really good, obviously, once it's all aromatic and people are coming out and asking what you're doing in there. There you go. Um, a little bit more umami, deep flavor. I like to put tomatoes in there. Um, just dice them up and just throw them in there. Okay. So we'll get that going. And then once that sort of settles down a little bit, any sort of Cajun seasoning, you can make your own. Or a lot of people with, with this recipe, a lot of people like to grab like market stuff. Like okay, like what? Choni chicory and those kind of things. Okay. All that. Um, either way you want to go. What's in yours? So you can go... Garlic powder, onion powder, oregano, thyme, paprika. Just just get the whole pantry and just okay. dump it in. Doesn't there. really matter, huh? <laughs> yeah. As long as you like the taste. As long as it's good. So that's okay. what I do. So once that's good, mm -hmm. add your little rice. This is where I go a little bit different. Everyone adds the broth first, but just like when we made Mexican rice or when we made... Uh, any of those rices where you, you kind of cook them a little bit. Okay. Remember, remember back a few segments back? I like to do that first. Oh, okay. It's just what I do. Is that's not the twist that's yet. That's not the twist. That's not the twist. Ah, that's not the twist. Everybody's okay. waiting for the twist. Then add some broth of your choice. Mm -hmm. Then we let the rice cook all the way. And then we let it cook. Mm -hmm. Put a top on there. 15 minutes later, you are going to arrive here. Ah. Take wow. you some scallions, toss that on there and you're good to go. So what is the twist? This is field roast. Um, we didn't start with any sort of butter and everything in here is veggie, veggie. This is actually vegan. So this is for everyone. Oh. It's well, for, what about the sausage then? You said this, what's? Field roast is protein or plant-based sausage. Oh, so, gotcha, gotcha. So I've, that's never why heard of, I've never heard of that. Yep, that's right. why I was so closed-lipped. You're like, and you're, you're getting to it. You're like, oh, why'd you do that? I'm like, oh, just. It's quiet. Quiet. it's quiet. <laughs> so okay. this is actually a vegan version. So anyone that has any any problems with meat, any problems with dairy, you can have this and enjoy jambalaya just like the rest of us. Yeah, it's all down to the nice. spices too, huh? The spices really make it happen. So, I mean, the Trinity is the Trinity, obviously. Um, umami in this. You can even put mushrooms in there. Oh. But when you put those spices in there, that's when the game. Yeah. So Tina, yes, I, I see I see one ramekin, but I see three people. <laughs> right. So oh, interesting. Mm -hmm. So we, maybe we'll get a taste in there and, <laughs> and see how that works Did out. Did you hear what she said? What? She one? said I hear I see one ramekin and three people. Oh <laughs> my. First, oh. What? Darla. Ash. Oh. oh okay. <laughs> okay, well, there's four right here. And there are four? Okay. Just saying. Well, uh, okay, well, yeah. <laughs> I'm all. Uh, I'll, be right, I'll, be, I'll be right back. Right. Okay, so tell me about where you're going to post these recipes. So these recipes will be on Cancel the Meetings. I'm a professional meeting dodger. You can go there. It's on Instagram. It's on TikTok now. Oh, my goodness. I'm, I'm you're moving little, up in the world. A little bit, you know. It's, it's little by little. Does your son approve of this? He, oh Teenage son. He is my biggest critic. I love. Oh, I, is he, he teaching you how to? No, Dad. You got to do it this way. He, that's him. Yeah. That's so him. There he comes in there and he's like, Dad. And he's so. I love how his his honesty. And he's a great cook. He really is. Really? Oh, yes, good. Yes. Good. He's doing it. So. Well, thank you, Eric. Appreciate it. Always Thanks. good to see you. Thank you very much. All Thanks right, Ash. All back right. Over to you. Can't wait to try it. All right. Thank you, guys.